Hologic presents a video guide to the collection of COVID nasal specimens by clinicians using the Aptima and Panther Fusion Swab Specimen Collection Kit. Begin by removing the swab from the package. To avoid contamination, do not touch the soft tip or lay the swab on a surface. If the soft tip is touched, laid down, or dropped, discard it and get a new swab collection kit. Now hold the swab, placing your thumb and forefinger on the middle of the shaft so they cover the score line if it's present. Do not hold the shaft below the score line. Carefully insert the swab into the patient's first nostril until resistance is met at the turbinates. This is half to three quarters of an inch into the nostril. Next, rotate the swab with moderate pressure against as much of the wall of the anterior nares regions as possible in a large circular path at least four times, which is about 10 to 15 seconds, and withdraw the swab from the nostril. Using the same swab, Carefully insert the swab into the second nostril until resistance is met at the level of the turbinates, which again is one half to three quarters of an inch into the nostril. Next, rotate the swab with moderate pressure against the wall of the anterior nares regions in a large circular path at least four times, which is about 10 to 15 seconds. Then remove it from the nostril. While holding the swab in hand, unscrew the cap on the transport tube. Do not spill the tube's contents. Do not pour out the contents of the tube. If the tube contents are spilled, discard and replace it with a new swab specimen collection kit. Place the swab specimen into three milliliters of VTM or UTM. The following VTM and UTM can be used. Ramel Microtest M4, M4RT, M5, or M6 formulations, Copan Universal Transport Medium, or BD Universal Viral Transport Medium. Acceptable alternatives include liquid amies, saline, or specimen transport medium. Immediately place the swab into the transport tube. If a score line is present, carefully break the shaft at the score line at the top of the tube. The swab will drop to the bottom of the vial, then discard the top portion of the shaft. Do not break the shaft above the score line. Do not cut the swab. Do not fold the swab in half. And do not puncture the top of the tube. Now tightly screw the cap onto the tube. Use the tube label to provide a unique identification of the specimen. After collection, specimens can be stored at 2 degrees to 8 degrees Celsius for up to 96 hours. COVID nasal specimen collection by clinicians with the Aptima and Panther Fusion Swab Specimen Collection Kit. To learn more, visit Hologic.com.